Aloha from Eva Beach. Today we're going to make Korean pancake number two. Oh, before we start, uh, last month my friends came over, Tina and Mel, and we filmed a spoof on the original Korean pancake. It was so good fun. They have a really high-tech camera, so no get scared when you see all my wrinkles. But they came over, we shot this spoof. It's really funny. Check it out on their YouTube. Or they have their own website. And their mission is to empower women through the art of conversation and film. <laughs> Check it out. They're so awesome. Girl power. Thank you. Mel and Tina. Today we're going to make Korean pancake number two. It's a little bit different. Um, the original one is more eggy. This other one I found, okay, there's a Korean restaurant in Mililani and I asked the lady, eh, how do you make this? And she said it's a potato Korean pancake. So I did some research, research. Oh, the bugger is hard to make because you're using the starch from the potato. I'm like, oh, that's plenty of work. So I did some more research, made some phone calls, and I found this recipe. The difference with this Korean pancake is the outside is crispy and the inside is kind of like mochi. It's so onalicious, broke them out. Today I'm just going to make a small amount because... It's my lunch, and um, anyway, I'll write all the ingredients down so you can make uh, more servings if you want. And real easy, just carrots and green onion. Okay, so like I said, we're just gonna do a small amount. So, one fourth cup flour, one fourth cup of rice flour, and one fourth cup of soy milk. This is my version. So don't get mad if it's not how you do it. Let me mix it up. Might, might need a little more soy milk. Or maybe not. Oh yeah, we do. Oh. One fourth cup of water. Mix them up real good, get rid of the clumps. If you want a thinner pancake, you can add a little bit water, more water, or a little bit more soy milk. This is the, or if you're making the fluffier, eggier um, Korean pancake, Korean pancake number one, you would use the Korean pancake mix. But today we're doing Korean pancake number two. So you're using regular flour and rice flour. So you can add whatever you want. If you want seafood pancake or you know you want to put onions, regular onions, white onions. Um, or get back in there. Um, anything. You can put anything. Sprouts. You can put anything in your pancake. Kind of tick ya. I'm gonna add a little bit more water. Get my toasted sesame seeds. Toasted sesame seeds. Ah, I love sesame seeds. Just a little bit sesame seed oil. A couple dashes of garlic salt for flavor. Pepper. 
pepper. I know, so sad. My sexy pepper kind of broke. I'm heating up the pan. Oil. Just a little bit of oil because it's a non stick pan. Just a titch. Mix them real good. Let's do a taste test. I might want it thinner. I'm not sure yet. I don't know, this looks good, this looks good. Oh, smell good. You heard that crunch. Yum, yummy. You see, you see that? <laughs> so good. Crunchy and chewy. Thank you so much for watching. Enjoy. Oh, please check out Eat Cake Gallery. Those girls are so awesome and their mission is awesome and amazing. Their work is awesome and amazing. Thank you for watching. Enjoy. Aloha from... <laughs> you heard that crunch. Yummy. Yum, yum. You see?